One of our local libraries is getting ready for some much needed renovations. Eyewitness News reporter Anya Whitehead was in Scranton today to see what work needs to be done. That's the son, the daughter, and the mom. Some people like Enrique Clotter and his two-year-old son, Asar, visit Lackawanna Children's Library every day. So learning, of course, is number one. Uh, that's what I like to, to do, so I definitely would like to implement that on my son, you know, and starting at an early age is definitely important. When Clotter arrived this day, he learned of upcoming renovations and was thrilled. Everything's not that bad, but it could definitely use a uh, touch-up, so that's definitely good. Library officials say the historic building, which is more than 100 years old, is in need of a makeover. Looking at the, uh, the wooden floor here in the Children's Library, we'll be refinishing that. We'll be refreshing the artwork that's on it. We also plan to refresh the children's restrooms here in, in the library. We'll be doing some work on the front doors in the building. While renovations are taking place, programs are still going to continue at the Albright Memorial Library next door. So none of our programs will be canceled, and in fact, they'll be taking place right next door in the Albright Memorial Library on the second floor um, of the, in what's uh, called the Henkelman Room. For Clotter and his son, they are happy to still be able to have their father-son time while the library is under renovations. It's definitely good that there's other programs, so you know when stuff like this happens, you can still you know, have something else to uh, do. In Scranton, Anya Whitehead, Eyewitness News. The library is scheduled to be closed from February 15th through the 27th.